let's look at, let's build another one and let's look at enrollments. So I'm going to go back to Data Explorer here on the top left. New question, say enrollments. And it'll let you get really specific. We could actually say enrollments of transgender females between the age of 24 and 62 or something like that. We, we could, we can specify as much as we want. It's a very versatile tool because we're actually just able to write our own queries here. Um, I'm going to go to enrollment though. And let's say, so what do you want to know? First, I want the client ID, right? So we can identify the individual. I also want, let's see, I want the program. I want the enrollment date. Where is that guy? There we go. And the exit date. I'm going to go down to which records do you want to include? And let's say I want all individuals who have an open enrollment or had an open enrollment between today and this date last year. I'm going to show you how to compound these a little bit. So enrollment date I'm going to say is less than or equal to today because we know they had to have been enrolled at some point before today. Then exit date I'm going to say is greater than or equal to this date last year. Now this will show individuals who were enrolled before today and who were exited after today last year, um, but it won't show anyone who was enrolled before today and wasn't exited yet. So we're gonna have to compound this a little bit. I'm gonna drop an exit date to this, this little blue folder or this little blue file right here. I'm gonna change this to or. I'm gonna make that null. So this will include anyone who was either exited in the past year or is still enrolled. Um, lastly, we'll want to specify the program because we don't want it to be for all programs. And again, I'm going to say HMIS Training Emergency Shelter. Um, we can also get more client level data. So. Let's say I want uh, gender, date of birth, that sort of thing. That's not all going to show up here in this domain, but it will show in the client's domain. So I can add this one. And then under what do you want to know, I'm going to drag, let's see, birth date. I can drag gender. Let's also put race down here. We can even get the individual's name. I'll put a first name right next to client ID and last name right there. And then if I hit show me, now this is pulling information from multiple domains, which is pretty cool. And it'll show me all the individuals listed here.